My name is Hussein Jabahirian. Uh, I was born in Iran and uh, in a Sufi family and I started doing yoga, actually transcendental meditation in 73 with Maharishi Mahesh Yogi and I practiced that until 1995 where for the first time I met Yogi Bhajan, uh, the master of Kundalini Yoga. And um, the way that I was introduced to Kundalini Yoga was through my medical doctor who was a Kundalini Yoga teacher. So I accidentally came across him and uh, he taught me and he encouraged me actually to go to summer sources for white tantric practice. So that was really something exceptional. And it was there that I learned that um, Yogi Bhajan is teaching for the first time in 1995. And I started um, taking courses with him in 95 and continued into 1996 for the <clears throat> level two uh, teacher training. And for me, actually, it was uh, transformational meeting Yogi Bhajan. In fact, it was the end of my search for um, on the spiritual path. Yogi Bhajan was a, a genius in my opinion, and he taught us actually that uh, you are in the world, but not of the world. And that was something which was outstanding. In other words, I could practice my professional um, work. Uh, I have a PhD in computer control systems and I work for a major auto company in Michigan. And uh, in fact, it enriched my life, whatever I was doing. I uh, strengthened my understanding of uh, who I am. He constantly, when you meet with him, he always told you who you are. So uh, basically, when I met him for the first time, he said, you are a teacher. So I kept it in my mind and I became a teacher. <laughs> so in that sense, it was transformational. It was a blessing actually to get to know him. It was very liberating. The entire meeting and practicing of Kundalini Yoga and White Tantric to me was transformational. Basically, Yogi Bhajan's um, mission was peace. But he always he was of the opinion that you cannot create peace without individuals being peaceful with themselves. So that was his focus. As you know, the Sikh um, religion is very open-minded about uh, various cultures, people with different backgrounds, very receptive. And this is reflected in the generosity of actually Yogi Bhajan. He would admit students of all faith but in a sense my heart has always been with the tradition of Kabir and Guru Nanak so in fact once when I met with uh, Yogi Bhajan he specifically told me that uh, maybe you should read and write about Kabir and Guru Nanak and this is what I've done it's very close to my heart actually I'm not a poet, but because I was brought up in the Sufi tradition, um, I have the privilege of reading um, Rumi in its original language, Persian language. And I think um, um, being from Iran, every Iranian you can claim that he is a poet. 3HO literally means healthy, happy, holy family. And that is very significant.